what even is a snail girl? The term was coined by the Australian designer Sienna Lutby in a piece for the fashion journal she wrote, A snail girl takes her time and creates to create. She's running her own race, and maybe that race isn't going anywhere but home and back to bed. So the idea is to prioritize a sustainable work-life balance to protect your peace, as Ludby puts it. Earlier this summer, we similarly had hashtag lazy girl jobs. And now let's be clear, we don't need to fear women collectively abandoning their career ambitions. But why do we have yet another girl hashtag on our hands? Well, firstly, girls kind of own social media right now. We've just had a summer of girl core aesthetics like Tomato Girl, and women have been winkingly exchanging their mental acrobatics and justifying expensive purchases under hashtag girl math. Secondly, this is about community building. When you dive into the snail girl videos on social, you actually find lots of people sharing their brush with burnout. And it makes sense for women to deploy hashtags that allow them to talk among themselves about shifting career strategies. Not least of all because women have a stress gap to match their wage gap. 74% of employed American women report being somewhat or very stressed over work versus 61% of the men. People are reframing their mindset around how they make a living and we'll be taking a closer look at the anti-ambition moment soon. 